I'm Lisa Figueres. I've been involved with the mining sector, with human rights, community engagement, community development. The responsibility of the mining companies is to make sure that this economic growth that is generated in the municipality is internalized in the municipality. So it pays taxes. Many of, of these taxes go directly to the federal government. Part of the public policies that are being generated in the federal government are return to these municipalities that are having an immense growth. When a project this size comes in, of course, it generates uh, jobs, it generates opportunities for local businesses, and the royalties just come during operations. So there is a timing problem. This connection with the federal government and the importance of accessing the finance for public policies in the federal government anticipates urban planning and a lot of investment in the municipality on the right time before the operation starts. And that's an area where mining companies can provide assistance and can help bridge the municipality needs with the resources available on the federal level. In the southeast of Pará, in Brazil, we have partnered with the city hall, with the mayor, and with the community, with uh, the technical body, and we have engaged with the federal government to bring public policies for education, health, to these municipalities. The lessons are that we have to work with cross-sector partnerships. We have to work with local government, with local NGOs, with communities. We must have trust between the partners with a long-term perspective of local development. And that applies not only in Brazil, but elsewhere as well. Thank you.